Hey guys, today I'm going to be doing another unboxing video for you, and if you can't tell, the box is huge. I got a package today in the mail, and it's from ToysRUs.com. Just a couple of hints, because I love these mystery unboxing things, I think they're a lot of fun. Uh, both of these items in here, there are two, are video game related. Both of them are exclusive to Toys R Us. One of them is from a character that actually has very, very few uh, collectibles out for that character. Actually, hardly any, and the ones that are out there are extremely rare and expensive. Um, the few that are known. The other one is a character that, um, let's just say, his past couple of games have not really been from the roots that the character originated from. They've kind of been a mix of all kinds of genres. And this character makes an appearance in Super Smash Bros. the series. So let's see what we got here. Wow. <laughs> it's pretty funny. The one box, the one package is actually huge. And the other one is pretty small. Um, I can see both. They really, in terms of packing material, I just use this here to separate the two. So, pretty boring there. Alright, so let me take out the first one. The larger one. Right, here we go. And it is a very large Donkey Kong figure, statue, whatever you want to call it. Um, he's semi-posable. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to take him out of the box and show you guys. But this is what he looks like in the box. It's rather large packaging. And this was exclusive to Toys R Us. So you can only buy this on their website or in their store. And you can see they have the little emblem right there telling you that it's exclusive to Toys R Us. Alrighty, so I got the Donkey Kong out of his packaging. As you can see, here's the box without him in it. The box is okay. It's a little bit bulky, though, for my taste in terms of displaying him. So I'm going to definitely display him outside of his box. And he comes inside of this plastic blister package. So let me take that off. This is definitely more... Definitely a display piece because he's in a set pose, and I th I'd like to think of it more as a statue than a figure. Um, and it's actually pretty light um, for his size. It's actually a very large statue. Believe it or not, this is actually only twenty nine ninety nine. Um, that I think that's an excellent price for this figure. I think years down the road, you know, hold on. Let me compare this to the Mario statue that I have that you guys know about. Okay, so here's the Mario statue that I have that retails for anywhere between seventy to a hundred dollars he also has a mushroom that goes in his hand but that'll just fall out while I'm lifting him up and here's the Donkey Kong which was twenty nine ninety nine so their size is actually I'd say this is an awesome value of thirty dollars because in terms of its scale look at that just as large in terms of the detail in Donkey Kong it's fairly good he's got his tie right here plastic tie everything is like a vinyl plastic and he's got the, um, the texture for his there all around them. Overall, it's a pretty cool figure. You can move his legs and his arm a little bit, but I don't really see what good that does because he's in a fixed pose anyway. Alright, so the next item here is Sonic the Hedgehog related. Those of you that collect Sonic the Hedgehog stuff, you should already know which character is extremely hard to come by in terms of collectibles, and that's Metal Sonic. And recently released is an exclusive Metal Sonic Comic-Con figure. Um, he's stylized to kind of have like this stylistic look to him. It's from a new series that they're coming out with, and this is the first one that they released, I believe. And it, it was exclusively sold at Comic-Con. However, Toys R Us has exclusive rights to it. Now, the funny thing about this is I actually read that some people's blockbusters, um, someone's blockbuster was actually selling this. Um, as well as, I would say, check your Toys R Us retail stores as well, but if not, you can always buy this online. Uh, it's fifteen ninety nine. It comes in a nice little blister packaging here. But I'm going to go ahead and unbox this, because he seems like he's pretty easy to put back in there. Uh, when I want to display him. Alright, so I cut it open. Let's see what he looks like here. Comes in a pretty basic blister package. And he very easily just pops right out. Alright, maybe not so easily. Alright, so here he is outside of his packaging. It's a pretty cool little figure. He's very light. He doesn't have a lot of weight to him. Uh, you can articulate him in his waist, both of his arms, and his head. This is a cool little display figure. It has sort of like a semi-metallic shine to it. And uh, I think it's a really cool figure. I mean, Son Metal Sonic 
merchandise really is not common at all. So seeing this come out uh, was definitely a surprise. You can get this for $15.99 on Toys R Us's website, or you can try their uh, your luck at your local Toys R Us, or maybe even your Blockbuster, but I highly doubt uh, <laughs> that every Blockbuster will have these. I think that was sort of just like a rare circumstance. So there you go, guys. I got two awesome figures from ToysRUs.com. I got this really cool little Metal Sonic Comic Con exclusive for $15.99, as well as this very large and very cool $29.99 Donkey Kong statue or large figure. Thanks for watching, guys.